Hello, sweet friends and crafters. Welcome to Carol's Craft Cottage. For today's video, I am sharing the September 2024 release of Scrap Diva Design dies. And as you can see by the top one, it is filled with awesome Halloween dies. I'm so excited to start really getting into Halloween crafting. I am going to have a list of the dies in the description box. They will not have any links right now because the dies are not available till September 1st. But you can use Carol 10 at checkout for 10% off your order. So let's get started looking at these awesome dies. So I know if you've been following along with me, you know I love Memory Dex cards and I love making the Halloween or fall or Christmas themed memory decks box boxes with uh, all different cards in them. So what we have here is called the Spiderweb Memory Decks Shaker. This is the part that makes your shaker. And then you have a double spider web. You have the memory decks cards and then you get two spiders one that's dangling off a spider web and then one that's just as plain spider and the eyes and you get two of those on the one die this is so super cute and i can't wait to make some memory decks cards next we have what is called the witch broom shakers there are two different brooms in this set you get this one that is sort of like a triangle and then you get this shape right here. And there are two uh, dies for each shape of the brooms for layering for your shaker. And this is really cute for embellishing your projects. The next one we have is the Spider Bow number two. And as you can see, when I flipped it over, you get two pieces uh, of the bow there. There's the bottom, and then there's a smaller one of this which appears to layer on top of this. And then you get a spider web that's in the shape of bat wings to layer on the bow. And there is a spider under here. And when I show you my projects with this die, I will share with you how the bow layers and what you get in this set. Really, really cute for your Halloween projects. Next, we have the mini ghost tag. And you can see here you have the background and then a layering piece with stitching. And you get the dies that help decorate your little ghost. This little piece goes on top of the area that cuts out for your ribbon and twine. And then you get bows and their mouth, eyes, all sorts of different things to decorate your cute little ghost tag. I love these little tags to tie on to plastic pumpkins. Now, when you give special things out to like your nieces and nephews or children and grandchildren, you could tie this onto a plastic pumpkin. Or this would also look cute if you give out little Halloween uh, coffee cups with uh, packets of hot cocoa or the little um, cups of coffee in them that you use in your Keurig. Uh, this would be cute tied on to that as well. So you will see some projects coming up with that soon. Next, we have the Little Spooky Halloween Shaker Plate. And this has lots of fun designs. As you can see here, there are two different bats. There's this one and this one, two different. Then you get the skull and crossbone, and then you get a little ghost. And then on this side, you have spiders, and these are uh, moths, or they could be dragonflies, but I think they're supposed to be moths. And these are great for making shaker material for your shakers for Halloween. Next, we have a super cute stamp set, and it is called, um, I guess it doesn't have a name. It's just a stamp set. 
as you can see when I flipped it over really quick, you do get all the dies that match the stamps in this set. And here is a really, really cute ghost family. There's the daddy, the mommy, the little boy, and the little girl. You get this really cute little bat. And he looks so much like this really popular bat that they sell at, uh, it's Marshall's Home Goods and TJ Maxx. There's a, a little bat that's been very popular for home decor, and he looks a lot like him. Um, I think he's adorable. And you get a spider web, and like I said, you get all the dies for everything in this stamp set. The words are Spooky Wishes, Happy Halloween, You're Fabulous, I bet you don't know. I love you. I think you're amazing. And then under this is a like a cartoon uh, enclosed word called boo. And super, super cute. Can't wait to play with this because these stamps are darling. Next, we have this called the Witch Shoe Jelly Bag. How cute is this? And it's got witch shoe cutouts. And this is great for putting candy and gift giving. Also for happy mail and swaps. And then you get uh, shoes to cut out and this little background piece to put those shoes on to help decorate your little jelly bag. Can't wait to play with this and make this up. I bet you this is going to turn out really cute. There'll be a lot of fun examples from the design team. Next, we have the Halloween pocket tag. And when I first saw this, I had an idea to put my Halloween earrings in this, that this would be a great way to gift them. And if you follow along with me, I did do a bracelet box with a 3D embellishment book. And after that video, I did a bracelet tutorial and earring tutorial. So I will have the earrings um, on here for you to see how it looks. I think this is going to be cute. So you do get trick or treat and you get a spider and then you get like a coffin type of tag here. And I can see me mounting the earrings on this coffin tag and putting it inside the pocket. Really, really cute. So I'll have that for you so you can see what it looks like. Next, we have a mini album. And this has the word Halloween. So it's a Halloween mini album. So you get the base piece. You get the uh, stitched piece to decorate your pages. And then you get the word Halloween that you can cut out and layer the letters to make them pop up on your mini album this is super cute i can't wait to do this one too i have some ideas for that next we have the voodoo doll mini album and here he is in all his cuteness you have three layering dies with this one you can see he has an x and a regular circle for his eyes and then his little die has all these little markings that look like stitching how cute is that? So this will make a mini album. Next, we have this really, really fun die. This is a witch hat box. And you get the words Hocus Pocus with the background. You get the little uh, dies here that decorate the witch hat. This is the brim. And then you get this piece, these pieces to make the box of your witch hat. So we'll be working on this pretty soon. It is so cute. I can't wait to do it. And I think that um, my bracelets would be nice in this box as well for a gift. So I can't wait to make that. Next, we have a Spiderweb mini album. And you hear, can see here you get three big dies. You get the base the stitched and the spider web, and then you get two good sized spiders. How fun is that? This is gonna be cute too. 
can't wait to work with that. My mind is going. <laughs> and last but not least, you get Halloween words number four. In this set, you get several words with the backgrounds. You get broom, vibes, hocus pocus, hey boo, spooktacular, and trick or treat. And this is a um, really cute font as well. Um, and did I say, oh, I didn't say that um, it has parking. There's a word parking in here. I'm just looking at my list because I... Um, I did a list and then I had to cut some to see <laughs> see what the words were and you could see that um the parking the uh font on that is really cute. Do can you see that a little bit? Anywho, I forgot the word parking. So that is the September 2024 release from Scrap Diva Designs. Be sure to come back to my channel on September 1st and I will have several projects for you that I will be sharing. Thank you so much for joining me today. I appreciate you all so very much. And until the next video, remember to sprinkle kindness like confetti wherever you go and happy crafting. Bye-bye.